Um, Yeah, so we'll just go fight some, some movers and some magic pots to get some levels because we're incredibly underleveled. That'll give Cloud a little more HP and then he should be able to survive fine and then we can do the Ballerina, get Omni Slash and W Summon, get Final Attack, and then we'll be all set. Because Final Attack is going to be necessary for Emerald Weapon, unfortunately, unless we use sources. There's just no way to survive him otherwise. The, the blue eyes will kill us every time. I mean... I guess... I'm trying to think. With W item... With W item we might be able to survive for a while, but the the blue eyes will kill us, so we would need to have a strat to like kill the blue eyes immediately as soon as they spawn, which might be kind of rough. we use like quadra magic ultima let me think here for a second if we use quadra magic ultima with hero drinks we might be able to do max damage but then whoever has that would have to not get hit by No, see, I don't think it's gonna work, cause, cause, revenge stamp will just kill us. So, yeah, revenge stamp will probably just kill us. Style will help it miss, but we're on such a low level it will probably get hit anyways. I don't know, we could try it. I still need to level up a bit though. And we need something to do damage. So I think to get like 4x cut or something. Just so I can actually deal damage. And then maybe like, and then maybe like Yuffie, Yuffie 4x cut could get us there with a lot of W item stuff. Because I wanted to try to beat him without without going out of the realms of the challenge. And I feel like it's possible. But without final attack, I just don't know if we can survive like through his second phase. I probably won't grab mine. My my plan still is to not use anything from the Materia Caves unless I have to. Um, I 
Let's see here. Shoot, I didn't buy root almonds. Wizard armlet. The wizard bracelet it is. Do I really want to level up? Maybe magic counter? Or counter? Death blow. Apocalypse. I don't have much of anything. I do have Magic Home though, which I forgot about. Magic Home and uh, Wind Slash. So. Yeah, we're not really like in the best position to grind here, but I'm not planning on grinding that long. I mostly just want experience more than anything. I'll level up Quadra Magic even though I'm not using it currently. I'm trying to think in my head like what we could do to beat Emerald Weapon without actually doing like chocobo stuff. And I'm trying to think if we could even beat him without final attack. We would really need to do a lot of damage. Wow. That damage though. Could have been stellar. Teller damage. Uh, 
Um, I don't know. Maybe give it a try. It's going to be a lot of just dying. <laughs> because anyone that gets hit by his physical attack would just die. Hey. Well, if we're doing it without Chocobo stuff, then, uh... Then we would be, uh... We wouldn't use Quadra Magic. But yeah, that's kind of what I'm thinking. Is using a lot of Demi. And, but we need something to get rid of his blue eyes right off the bat. As soon as he moves over, we need something to get rid of the blue eyes. Uh, and I don't really have anything. Ooh, movers. Uh, I need to try not to die, though. Which can be tough, because these guys are really fast. See, Ultima and Bahamut don't really work because they only hit once, and they have just enough HP to survive two hits of max damage, so you need to do three hits, basically. This is what we wanted. This XP is like huge. Or actually the AP. They don't give XP though. But the AP is huge. And the money is actually kind of nice too. The XP from the magic pots is really good. And master combos aren't actually that bad either. Everything down here is good to fight. Uh, what's the easiest way to kill you? Probably like, probably like Comet 2 with Hero Drinks maybe. I don't even think Cloud has Magic Plus though, so he's not going to do that much damage. Demi doesn't work on these guys, right? I'm not actually sure if it does or not. Cool, it heals him. Perfect. Just what I wanted. Let's see how much damage this does. I feel like not much. Shadow Flare would do more damage. This does like... Not even max damage. Does like 8,400. Cloud's dead. Oh, we dodged it. Oh, now he's dead. I might not fight Master Tom Barrys, they just take too long. Just 
I don't, as far as I know, there's no real good way to beat Tom Berries other than like Omni Slash, Night Slow Round. Otherwise, you're just sitting here, hitting him with Shadow Flare over and over. This probably won't even kill you, V. Oh, no, I, I guess I have been using her like all games, so. Hope he doesn't use a knife. Crap. That's unfortunate. Uh, that sucks. So what do we do? Do we go back down there? Do we cheat? What do you guys think? I'm trying to think. What's the best way to do this without grinding for a long time but still keeping the challenge alive? I could place myself down there and get rid of the walking. Well, I'm trying to grind for levels, but my materia could also use some help. If I'm going to beat Emerald Weapon without final attack, I'm going to need to... I'm going to need a couple things. Yeah, but I need more than 200, especially if I'm mastering W item. Part of me wants to do this like legit, and part of me wants to just cheat it. Since we've all seen grinding in this game before. I really have that little money. I didn't mean to dig. <laughs> It'd be funny if you could just leave. Potion. Let's go, boys. It's all my tissues, dude. Those are worth a ton. Yeah, I'm see I might I might cheat, but I'm just trying to think of like how I want to cheat it. Do I just go ahead and master everything that I want mastered, but maybe try without final attack? Like I'm not gonna give myself final attack, because I haven't earned final attack. 
But all the material that I currently have would just be going and mastering it. So, and usually when we get to this point, we just cheat it because, uh, you know. No, I'm not cheating in master material. We're not really cheating. We're just shortcutting, you know, everything that I have so we don't have to go down and fight magic pots for like two hours. This is something we've done in a lot of our challenges. It's just, I don't really need to master everything. I just want more damage because we're not going to be able to, we're not going to be able to fight Emerald with what we have currently. Welcome back, Regal. What's up, Maggie? Alright. So, let's see here. Let's just do a North Cave shortcut. So let's say cloud let's just put everyone at level 65 which is still pretty low but you know we can work with it. And then with materia um, I don't want to go too crazy, but I need something Need something that's gonna kill the blue eyes, which means I either need to use quadra magic or I need some kind of combo in place or I might be able to get away with 4x cut, but that's gonna take some luck. That'll take a lot of luck. I'm just kind of giving myself like one mastered of all the stuff I was going to grind. I'm not going super crazy. Um... We're not cheating for Final Attack Phoenix. We're not cheating for Final Attack. I didn't earn Final Attack. I'm only shortcutting materia I already had so we don't have to fight magic pots. But what else would I want? Hmm. Just trying to think. What could, what could we do to keep... Keep the spirit of the challenge alive. Still HP to MP. No Chocobo stuff. No Knights of the Round. What could I do to do enough damage? I don't think counterattacks go off from Emerald Beam. HP Absorb won't do anything. I'm going to get one shot by everything. 
One thing I do want is three W items. Let's uh let's experiment a little. I wanna see on level sixty-five does Yuffie have any reasonable chance to dodge uh to dodge his attacks. Um what do I even want to give you? Nothing really helps. So maybe cur maybe the curse ring to be honest. You just hope you dodge everything. That's <laughs> that's basically where we're at. Just hope you don't get hit by literally, literally everything. Everybody gets a W item, and everybody gets an HP to MB. And then you get 4x cut, and a. So I don't even think counter death blow is going to matter because you're just going to die to everything. But you might counter death blow. Emerald Beam, and if you do, then that would be, that would give us a big chance. Um, you're gonna do Ultima MP Turbo Magic Counter Comet? <laughs> I guess? Oh, I should have leveled up Gravity. Um... Counter gravity. <laughs> to me, it seems like this is, uh, this Hydra, you're gonna die anyways. <laughs> like you're not you're not surviving, so it's probably a little reason to even have it. I don't know, maybe. I don't know what your I don't know what your vitality is at, but I feel like I feel like you're going down with the ship. Actually has 700 HP. Uh, maybe it's possible that we survive this. Magic, just so we don't have to go grab it. Um, wait.
Okay. For a second I was thinking something, but I was wrong. Um, w Magic and Gravity Materia that doesn't suck. a setup for me walking in and dying immediately, which is what's going to happen. I mean, part of me wants to think that with four hero drinks and big guard, Cloud could potentially survive a physical attack. But on level 65, I, I don't even think, I don't, I don't think that's even a thing. And I don't even think I'll get there. What is my battle speed at? It's probably fastest. That's not what we want. I have death force, right? I hope so. Oh, no, it's not slow. If I can get really lucky and get some misses, I might be able to. Uh, I might be able to power up Yuffie to the point where she can survive things. But that's if he's nice to me. doesn't look good. Uh, I just don't, I don't think this looks good. I think Yuffie could probably dodge now. Nope, she didn't even dodge. Yeah. Didn't even dodge. So... I guess my next question is... Does she have any chance of surviving even at level 99? Because leveling up in this game really doesn't give you that many stats, to be honest. But it gives you a little bit of an exponential boost with hero drinks, so... A lot of it depends on the rolls you get, too, because level ups are not always the same in this game. Every time you level up, it gives you a roll out of several stats. Get back here. Even with the Zydrick, uh, like, Red 13 did not have a good time. Actually, no, I don't think anyone has this Zydrick right now. I think about it. Maybe I should give Yuffie the Zydrick instead. Now that she has 810 HP, Zydrick might actually... She might actually survive with the Zydrick. Oh, uh, it sure ain't looking good so far. Live. All right. We 
We need big guard up before that. I think this is possible. I think with what we have, we, this might actually be possible. But it's all going to depend on how much damage I can do to the eyes. Let's not kill you off the bat. That would be cool. Well, I guess it does get rid of her countdown. That's nice. Yeah, HP to MP does a weird thing where it makes the enemies limit at 999 damage because your max HP is 999. It's kind of funky. I'm not sure why the game does that, but it does. Yuki can survive with this setup. Did I throw a Phoenix down to myself? What? <laughs> also, how did Red 13 survive that? I guess with Barrier he did. Alright. I think we can do this. We just need a really good ATB roll. I need him to not, like, get first turn. And also... I believe in the heart of the cards, do you? That's that's the question I have here for you, ladies and gentlemen. Do you believe in the heart of the cards today? How dare you. Kill Red 13 again. Hey, actually. Oh no! If he's gonna die. Because she's hasted. <laughs> Never got with haste. With haste, this goes off much faster. got a really interesting idea that might make this easier. I 
need to change something else though. I'm going to give Yuffie Doom of the Living. Because I think we're going to need it. I think that's where we can get our damage on this fight. To get rid of the eyes. Um, but I just realized that Yuffie will die to... Uh, air Tam Storm. So, we need to do that. And also, that'll help give her a little more HP. Do you think it'll still do 1,111 damage? Well, as long as I get rid of the eyes right away, I'll be fine, but that might not happen. Yeah, it probably will always kill me, now that I think about it. He's so fast! Stop being so fast, Emerald Weapon. Just cut it out. gotta everything has got to go right here <laughs> Man. I need I feel like I need to set the game to wait to get the turns I need Some kind of strategy, that's for sure. Vaccines work for that, do they? I don't have death force, so that's a problem. I mean, she could just die and I could revive her, but... enough time to like 
get set up. Oh nice, Vaccine does work on that. That's dope. We are incredibly dead now. <laughs> we are so dead. We are beyond dead. But if I get lucky, and Cloud gets Ultima off in time, maybe we could survive. But I doubt. Or if this hits the right things. Man, that's doing a lot of damage. I knew the Conformer was good against Emerald Weapon, but... I only have like two hero drinks in me. That's a lot of damage. That might actually do it for us. Dude, dope. So that's the plan. Doom of the Living every time he, he transforms. And hope that that gets us over the finish line. Now it's a race <laughs> to try to keep our stats up and try to do damage. I need... I need everyone else to have enough hero drinks to survive, and I don't know if they do or not. find out. Cloud, don't die. Don't die, Cloud. Oh, yeah. Oh, Ripper. I think I need Zydrix on everybody in order for that to pan out. But honestly, like, Cloud can die. It's not the worst thing ever. 76 damage! What a legend. Did Big Guard just miss again? Oh no, I have a vaccine. That's the problem. Hit. Uh, that's not good. 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 Scale from 1 to not good. That's not good. At least I can big guard her again. This is tricky. It's tricky to keep everybody full up, you know. Oh, that's bad. I lost. I lost horribly. There's like nothing I can do here. Because Yuffie's not gonna get her limit from this because she has too little HP. No one else can do any damage. I think I have a good strat though, in my head. I feel like... I feel like this could work. It just all needs to go well. And you need to hit the blue eyes. That's not the blue eyes. You're not hitting the blue eyes. <laughs> You're not doing the thing. Red 13 took two damage! <laughs> Red 13, a god. Dude, Red 13 is taking, z like, no damage. I, I don't know what's happened to him. I don't even know why he's taking so little damage. He has, like, three hero drinks in him. I don't even think he has his eye drink. Why is he taking so little damage? I don't even know why that's happening, but I'm not going to complain. Because <laughs> he's a legend, that's why. I have no idea why Red 13 is, like, invincible right now. 
two damage. Two. He took two damage. I don't know why, I don't know why Red 13 is like, unstoppable, huh? He took 560 damage from Emerald Beam because it's percentage based. It always does the same damage. Cloud, can you get a turn? That would be great. Keeps revenging Cloud's counter. Which is annoying. Need to get rid of that counter. This should kill us unless he dodges. He didn't dodge. Forgot to turn my Wait a second. My phone is on do not disturb. Why did it make a call noise? God dang it, phone. Android updated to the nine whatever and it broke my whole phone sound and vibration muted but allow alarms and media yet you just went off you just made a noise when someone called me okay it literally says muted it literally says muted and it made a it made a noise Feels good, man. Freaking new phone garbage. Alright, uh. Let's rethink this. I guess it's because Zydrick Tuffering. That's probably what got him there. Zydric. Full Zydric time. Let's do the thing. No, no, like, it used to be... See, they screwed up the Do Not Disturb thing. I love the Do Not Disturb thing, the old Android. It worked perfectly for me. I could have my phone turn on and show me, like, uh, I could have my phone turn on but not make noise so I could see it while I'm streaming, but now it's like either I have to ignore the, the call altogether, or, uh, It makes noise. So I'm actually going to let Yuffie die. Because I don't have Death Force. Um, I can't believe she already does max damage. 
Informer is so strong. I don't even need the curse ring. Survive that? Probably not. Did that actually interrupt my second hero drink? That's interesting. I didn't know that was a thing. Ah, uh, this is a problem. This is a big problem. Call 9800. Big problem. What's up, Gluthix? Just gonna kill everybody. Well, Cloud's act Cloud actually survived it. He'll get two Ultimas off. So now all the eyes should be like pretty close to dying. So if Red 13 can do anything, we'll be fine. But I used Big Guard on him because I was hoping Cloud would survive, but he didn't. This is a really fun Emerald battle. It's like, I actually have to make everything work and fast, you know. This is a good Emerald battle. I'm glad I tried this. I didn't give you any magic, right? So you gotta use, like, magic breath or something. Just anything to get rid of the eyes. Go get Red 13, Cosmo Memory. Then you could just ignore him and use the Limit Break and get rid of everything. Oh, cool, that heals. Alright. Never mind on that one. Run away, Red 13. Let me find. Alright, screw the Curse Ring. I need Yuffie to be alive and ready for that first thing. And she's already doing plenty of damage. So instead of the curse ring, you can have... Uh, tough ring. And you can have a toss ring. This time with feeling. 